Hello everyone and welcome to GFTL. I am your host Josh and today I am playing Grip, a 7 day FPS game uh, that I absolutely love. Uh, may I say before I begin that this uh, start screen is, is really stylish. I love the, the font and the, the way the thing shows up when you've selected it. That's really cool. Uh, I don't know why I like it so much, it just looks really awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and press the start button if it'll let me, there we go. And as you may be able to tell, this is, ooh, if I can do it properly and not shine light in my eyes, this is very similar to Mirror's Edge, except um, kind of more physics-y uh, in the fact that you can actually grab onto literally any surface. Whee! Uh, it's like, if you see in the top right, there's like a timer and, uh, ooh, if, if you can get over the edge there. Whoa, flung my, myself really far into the air. Okay, cool. Well, uh, yeah, it's a, kind of a time trial race. Uh, there's a, a really awesome course that you get and obviously it was made in seven days, so it's not, ooh, missed that one. No, I didn't. <laughs> I let go as soon as I gripped onto that. Okay, awesome. Let's try that again and climb up here. And you just kind of um, use the control. Oh no, I did that. I did that wrong again. No, I was supposed to grab onto that wall first. See if I can recover from this. Yeah, the controls are space to power up your jump. You see the like power up bar at the very big, very bottom there. Uh, and left click to hold on to something. You can also use your right hand to grab onto stuff, but uh, you don't actually need to. You, you can just use one hand. Okay, let's see if we can get onto here. Awesome. It's got some nice momentum stuff going on here. Uh, like if you kind of throw yourself off the side of a building. Whoa. Uh, you just kind of have to run with it, with the moment momentum that you have. And uh, it can sometimes throw you off of a building. Ooh. I'll I think it feels really cool when you just only just manage to grab onto the ledge of a building. I mean, you can grab onto the onto the bottom or side of a building anyway to save yourself. But it just looks cooler. Oh no, no. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's. Ooh. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing now. I just I'm I'm assuming there's some kind of flow that you can get. Whoa. But, oh no, no! <laughs> uh, but if you, if you really get into it, you can maybe sort out some kind of flow of movement, but really, I have to stop and start and look where I'm going <laughs> before before I make any kind of decision. Oh no! Oh. Any kind of decision as to where I'm going. Okay, let's try and leap onto that. Okay, that's kind of buggy. <laughs> I mean, your arm isn't a... you don't actually have any arms, you just got a hand. I mean, that's fine and everything, but it looks like you can... Oh no! No! Oh, I threw myself in the wrong direction! Oh, that was so close though. Okay, let's try this again. Um, yeah, I really like the kind of swooshy sounds and everything. It, it makes it feel a lot cooler when you're just jogging along. No! Oh, balls, balls, balls. Oh, I thought I had, like... Um, I don't know what happened there. Maybe there's something... I think there's something wrong with the, the jump ability, because it keeps on not jumping properly or something. Maybe I'm being stupid, but that might just not be working properly yet. Just caught that ledge. Awesome. And I can't seem to get back. Uh, run up. Run up! There we go. I mean, we've taken we've taken quite a while about this already, but really, uh, we're not racing against anyone, so I think we'll take this a leisurely uh, a leisurely place. Yes, um, this is a pretty cool kind of parkour experience. Yeah, I I'd, I'd count it as a parkour experience. Uh, I think it's rather fun. Almost didn't make that one. <laughs> Okay, let's see if we can make this fast. Oh, and then up onto the thing, awesome. See, you can kind of get into a flow of things 
if you like take runs up and you get momentum going, you can send yourself in all sorts of directions. Um, which way am I going? It's kind kind of difficult to s tell exactly which way you're going to end up flinging yourself because obviously, um, if you're hanging on by one finger, uh, you, you're swinging and you may end up diverting in a slightly different direction. As you've seen, I've thrown myself off of places before, but still, this is the end, and if I grab onto it with my right hand, there we go. I win! Five minutes and four sec bronze? Okay. Awesome. Well, maybe we can go for gold. Either way, I think this is a, a really awesome game, and I, I'm sorry I didn't actually take the time to look at who uh, who designed it, but really, uh, they should be very proud of themselves for making this in seven days. This is really cool, uh, being able to swing. I mean, you can use both hands. It's weird if you do. Oh, there's a hole down there. <laughs> Didn't even realise. Ah, oh, oh yeah. Okay, okay. Stop swinging. Stop. Stop yourself. Check yourself before you mess yourself. Is that? I can't even remember. Anyway. Thank you for watching. I will leave a link in the description to where you can download this game. It is entirely free um, and hopefully, I don't, I don't know whether there's going to be any development continued on it. Often there are on these, um, on the awesome games that come out of game jams, the developers decide, what the f Okay, I didn't release the button there and I jumped. Anyway, yes, uh, hopefully there'll be more levels and stuff because that would be really cool. Um, so thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye. Yes!